Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Star Flames. If you're new here, subscribe to my channel, turn on your notification bell, and join the family. Now, guys, Jay Z is getting thrown under the bus by Jess Collins. If you guys remember, it was announced that Kendrick Lamar will be the headliner for Super Bowl 2025. And Jay-Z was like, I had nothing to do with that choice. Yes, I was part of the committee, but I wasn't the one who single-handedly arrived at this decision. However, Jess Collins is letting us know that Jay-Z is the one who actually arrived at this decision decision. Mm -hmm. Now, you guys might be asking, who is Jess Collins? He's a prominent figure in the entertainment industry, known for his extensive work as a producer. He has made significant impact on television events, including the Emmy, the Grammy, and the Super Bowl halftime show. Collins is the founder and CEO of Jess Collins Entertainment, a production company responsible for many high-profile events and TV show. Now, let's get into what Just Collins is saying because Jay-Z thought that he escaped it. Uh-uh. It's all coming out now. No. According to several reports that are not coming out because, again, many people were saying, you know, the Super Bowl being held in Louisiana, Little Wayne is a native. He has contributed significantly to the music there. And this would have been a highlight for a, Louis for a Louisiana native to be a part of the Super Bowl. No, it's not as though people are saying Kendrick is not deserving of this. But what people are saying is, you know, we've seen two people being a part of the Atlanta. Why not make it the same for Louisiana? So since then, there has been so many back and forth so many debates, numerous discussion. However, Jess Collins is laying it all to rest. He's saying Jay-Z basically is responsible for choosing the halftime performers. Now, according to reports, Super Bowl halftime show producer Jess Collins took the time to respond to fans about Lil Wayne not being selected for the halftime show next year and also spoke about how Jay-Z always made the right decisions when it comes to who who's performing. While speaking to Variety in a new interview released on Monday, Collins reacted to the social media outrage over Kendrick Lamar headlining over Kendrick Lamar being selected to perform instead of Lil Wayne. As we previously shared, Wheezy is a New Orleans native and many fans felt like Wayne should have been the headliner with the Super Bowl being held in a city next year, we love Wayne, Colin said to the news outlet. There's always a Vegas odds on who's going to get to perform, but I think we're going to do an amazing show with Kendrick, and I think everybody's going to love the halftime show. I know Kendrick is going to work exceptionally hard to deliver an amazing show. That's true. No doubt about that. Now, he further states collaborating with Jay-Z and his Rock Nation team to shape one of the most eagerly awaited segments of television's biggest annual event. When asked about who chooses the annual halftime acts, Collins responded by saying, it's a decision that Jay makes. He added, since we've been on board with that show, he made it every year and it's been amazing. He always picked right so i want to also add on that if you guys remember going back to um colin kaepernick no hip-hop artist wanted to host the halftime show after colin did the knee they blackballed him they asked rihanna rihanna was like heck no you don't like black people we don't like you either but then they got jc rock nation to basically you know manage the halftime show and that's when black artists decided that okay we're gonna do the super bowl halftime show again so with him saying that jay-z single-handedly you know them getting rock nation on board rock nation chooses the artist that rock nation is jay-z and they always do an amazing job he's definitely not telling a lie coming on record to say this it is true because it is something that we remember clearly that no hip hop artist wanted to host um the halftime show because of Calvin kaepernick 
that incident until Rogue Nation took over. So it makes sense. And no we have some clarity, some light has been shed onto the manor. I understand that, you know, Kendrick Lamar is the vibing artist up and running, popping popular. And again, we're hearing that we're going to see Little Wayne on stage for about five minutes. In that five minutes, I'm also learning that Nicki Minaj will be on stage. It will not be the first time that Nicki Minaj braces the Super Bowl stage. But I cannot wait to see if this is factual or not. Okay? Now, it is your time to chime in. What are your thoughts about Jess Collins revealing Jay-Z chose Kendrick for the Super Bowl and Jay-Z has been making the pick. I want to hear from you guys. While you're at it, thumbs up, share, stay safe, stay sweet, stay blessed, and see you guys later, honey. Bye, guys.